everyone, and welcome to today's Starting Ground video. So, it is Monday, and yeah, of course, uh, no particular predict is coming yesterday, and yes, I'll be right to today. And today being the Extreme Vav, uh, uh, Season 2, Episode 4, uh, this one be titled Cole and Order. Um, so yeah, this, um, uh, obviously came out yesterday, but now, of course, we're right to today. So, um, those are curious, like, uh, when those had, oh, we're right to this, and when, uh, so. Just a heads up to anyone who's not aware of this at this point. I will be back to this uh, future X-Ray Vava uh, episodes on Mondays. So yeah, um, I, I won't be able to act on Sundays since yeah, um, it was usually the days I relaxed or whatever. And of course, I still have work in the evening. So and of course, like these episodes, <laughs> these type of things like release really like while I'm at work. So obviously, I wouldn't be able to. Um, react to him right away. So yeah, in the future I will be reacting to these episodes on Monday. So yeah, please stop asking. But um, so yeah, um, from the last episode we uh saw, um, yeah, of course, um, um, Fav and Ash went on a date, but then they got a little uh, ruined with um the one the butcher guy attacking them and uh, and then uh Mogar coming in to also make a scene and or he actually got like a hurt too. I didn't really expect them, but picked them one night. And also had some glowing blood or whatever. And of course, and then in the end, X-ray Fav wanted to get like more. I was know more about all this and one night and, and uh, Ash told him uh, she knew uh, someone that could probably help out and uh, obviously probably gonna find on this episode. And uh, what I saw in the thumbnail and obviously about Ty Long, it's more like he's sound like detective or some police uh, type of, uh, thing or whatever. So, um, yeah, I'm pretty excited to see taste episode. So, <clears throat> sorry, I just had lunch. But anyways, so without further ado, let's get started. But first, and also with being on Mondays, um, I always like to go to my parents' house to do laundry. So don't be too surprised if I'm always going to be here on Mondays or <laughs> whatnot. So, yeah. So, let's react to extra Vav, Cole, and Order here. Yeah? In three, two, one, play. Okay. Their best of buds oh yeah, but I'm pretty sure like with them when you show all those people there the, by the lab, I'm pretty sure they'll probably have the butcher there, maybe they have one waiter guy. I don't know. I just guess it cuz they keep adding people to that thing. I just love these guys. Oh, yeah, this is Butcher. I think I saw the wear before. And it was kind of went by quick. I was really curious how many people could be at, at like at the last episode. Of this like it's probably pretty full. <coughs> this town, uh, you gotta have strength to live in this. Well, town. you have to see, Cole. I don't know. To fight, strength to survive. It's a dog eat dog world out there. Yeah. Looking at these streets, I can't help but wonder why are all these dogs eating other dogs? Wait, what? Don't they know that's cannibalism? Like dog dogs why are or dogs so stupid. <laughs> or maybe they're right. The only way to survive is to eat, or you'll be eaten. Just depends Flint on Cole. who's got the or stronger Flint appetite. Right. <laughs> nice. you can do it. That's when they showed up. Wait, I there. said knock. <laughs> knocking down is a form of knocking. <laughs> of all the doors Wait. to all the private <laughs> Like every time he talks with Black Boy. had to break down mine. There were two of them. One side. Uh, I'm pretty sure they could hear you, dude. The other was loud and obnoxious. Hey. What did you call me? <laughs> I took another sip of my coffee. This was going to be a long Wait, time. he's talking. <laughs> I told him I'd been expecting them. I've been expecting you. Uh. Why can't we meet one normal person in this town? Hey. The name's Cole. Flint Cole. Cool. Don't care. <laughs> you got your name already. I'm also the guy who's going to help you find who you're looking for. Mm. Unless you don't care anymore. Of course we do. Look, we brought the evidence. Ooh, yeah. I examined the weapon. Um, Stainless steel. Stained mahogany hilt. You know they can hear you, right? Jesus. <laughs> This is a stainless steel stained mahogany. Mahogany hilt, quality craftsmanship. Yeah, tell us what it means. The knife is black market, shipped in from Colombia, most likely. Hmm. The blood, on the other hand. Yeah, it's interesting. I'd never seen anything like it. I put my pride aside and told him the truth. I don't. Let me guess. <laughs> you don't know. If the knives are shipped in. Wouldn't someone at the docks uh, know about them? You're on the right track, kid. Good thinking. An ex-con I put away a while back works the shipyard. Hmm. We'll see if he's got any fingers in that pie. Right. Ship it, docks. Oh yeah, of course I had to do that with Law and Order. Nice. 
I hadn't seen I remember watching Tony a long while 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 Pieces of our minds. Yeah. Is that right? Leave yeah. the talking to me. You two be the muscle. Well, the name fits. <laughs> Hello, Tony. You again? Look, man, I ain't been up to nothing, I swear. Liar! We know you've been smuggling in cutlery. Most muscles are silent. Mm -hmm. This look familiar, Tony? Never mm. seen it before in my life. Mm. You sure? Not ringing any bells? I don't have time for chit chat. I gotta move all those boxes from over there to over here. Don't make this difficult, Tony. It doesn't have to be like the last time. You and your circus friends take a hike. Takes one to know one, clown. Hospital. <laughs> <laughs> oh, parade. Did he talk? Uh, his fists did, and they were very clear. Left you a little badge of courage, too. Yeah. Bab, that's it. Uh, what's it? Tony was wearing this ring. Whoa. Looks like he's a member of the Architects. Like the Matrix. They're a secret society, known for some questionable dealings. Mm. Oh, right. My thoughts exactly. Yeah, hey, sure. my face helped too! <laughs> Let's shake them down, boys. Alright. Alright, the Architect Secret Society. Hmm. Keep your peepers uh, peeled for any suspicious characters. Oh, uh, there's a lot of suspicious two characters. we superheroes and a private eye stuck in the 40s. Literally no one's more suspicious than us. <laughs> Wait, hey guys, Rusty, I wasn't expecting to see you with him. Bonjour, Rusty. It's been a while, quite a while, ever since that fateful night that changed our lives forever. The night we both spent years trying to forget. Really? Uh, what, what happened that night? You're hanging out with this Sherlock wannabe? <laughs> Trust me, you don't want this guy behind you. He'll just leave you sore and filled with regret. Hmm. What exactly happened between you two? But he's helping us trace down Mogar. We found something that led us here. What is this place? Yeah, just a bunch of secret society nut jobs telling kooky stories. I come for the free food, but oh. I'll stay for the orgies. Oh, uh, what? And the free food. Uh. Any interesting stories lately? I'm not playing detective with you, Cole. Not after you screwed me. And I'll be damned if I let you screw these two. You know what? Never mind. I don't want to know. Come on, Rusty. Do it for us. Take a look at this knife. Uh, the knife's nothing special. But that blood. Crazy Dave mentioned having some kind of religious experience after seeing a trail of glowing blood leading into the woods. Really? But... That was Crazy Dave, so... Well, um, <laughs> Sounds like that luminescent blood trail should lead us right to him. To the woods! You guys leaving? The party's just getting started! Oh, the woods, still Saturday. <laughs> I'm really liking this episode, it's pretty cool. How do we get all the way up there? Climb it? I'm pretty sure I can jump that. Sure. Uh, we oh, had for fuck's sake, Ray, I actually put some effort. But no pot of gold. The failure was my own. I put too much faith in myself. Mm. I knew deep down I couldn't be the hero these two kids needed. I had no business calling myself a private eye. Oh. I should just go. Hey, shut up and start climbing. <laughs> Is this Mokar's nice place? place? Real rustic feel to it. Any sign of him? Hmm, nope. I think this is his room. I can hear him sleeping. Let's go. Oh, yeah, I can hear too. He's sleeping up? Guys, Interesting. look at this. I think this is his... Is that a diary? What a nerd! <laughs> right. This could break the case wide open, Bab. Does it have all his feelings in it? Dear diary, today, <laughs> Mogar smashed things. But no matter how hard Mogar try, Mogar can't smash angry feelings. <laughs> Would you be quiet? She's been gone for a month now. No sign of who took her. I feel my strength leaving me. I can't go on much longer. Oh, shit. Sounds like a lost love. Yeah. Sounds dumb as hell. Hmm. Two more Why is he three hours? from a mental hospital. What else does it say? And now I am injured, not healing as fast without her. Hmm. Time is running out, and my search has been fruitless. Oh dang! Mogar will find you, mother. Bloody hell! He's lost his mom. Oh no! Is she some kind of medicine woman, maybe? He's getting weaker. I bet I could take him now. Oh, we should take this and get out of here. Hey guys, what you what? find? What's she Gosh. doing there? What are you doing here? I've been telling you guys. Oh. This place is pretty neat. What the heck are you doing? <laughs> You're gonna wake him up! Bow. What is this? Uh, You'll never take me, thieves! Oh uh, no! Listen, I know how this looks, but we're only trying to help. Nothing good comes from your help. Now you've trespassed. You all must pay. Oh balls. Well, I'm not sure how much worse this can get. Yeah. Oh, oh god damn it! I'm just gonna shut my mouth. <laughs> no! Black it! 
Come on, move it! Bird! B bird! Oh! <laughs> Kazuki! Move quickly! I can't do both! I should hold still, right? It's sights based on movement! Where's that dinosaurs? Dinosaurs? Ah! Oh no, it wasn't for Kazuki! No, 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 dinosaurs. <laughs> This guy has actually got burned here. Burned down around me, Cause uh, those who know, like, yeah, um, in Minecraft, uh, Michael's character was Banjo Kazooie, so yeah, obviously Mogar be based on uh, Banjo, and then I was having burned based on Kazooie. That's nice. Oh shit! Look! Oh yeah! By the way, well that went all pear shaped. Yeah, thanks to Katie Couric over here. <laughs> hey, I didn't mean for this to happen either. Yeah, right. You don't care what happens as long as you get a story out of it. Oh. Well, I mean, let's not go accusing anyone. Yeah. Keep it together, you two. You're on the brink of a breakthrough. I felt as though I should warn them. If they go down this path, they'll need to be strong. Yeah. Their ties will be tested. Their wills bent. Who's there? If they're going to survive in this town, no. If they want to be true heroes for this town, well, that's gonna take more strength than even Mogar has. Who is that? I just hope they don't run out of it. Oh! Hello there. <laughs> <laughs> I think it. <laughs> nice. Oh man, I wanted to see you come back. Yeah, you yeah, was only around for an episode, but that's really great that he's coming back. Oh man, I can't wait for the back in next episode. Oh shit. True heroes save the day by clicking the subscribe button. Yeah. They also save the day by buying stuff in the store and <laughs> watching videos. I've got a few days, but how many extra bad stuff? Okay. Oh, animation thing. Okay, so that's extra rap. Vab, all colon order. And yeah, that was a pretty interesting episode. And very enjoyable. I like that one. So yeah, that was like the longest of the episodes so far, and yeah, that, that was pretty nice, because yeah, we definitely all got to meet, um, uh, Flynn Cole here, the uh, private detective, and I, re I really liked this character, especially the way he uh, monologue out loud so uh, everyone can hear what he's basically uh, talk uh, telling himself or whatever, so, and I definitely liked when it went uh, back in Y, where we, uh, did that, I really liked that type of stuff, that was very nice, and of course, all the um, Law and Order references, especially with the cuts, you know, like from certain uh, specific uh, date and uh, location stuff, that was pretty nice. And then, um, yeah, the like the specific like uh, stuff they um, investigate here based on Mogar, that's pretty cool. And obviously, go to that secret society to see Russ is there, just there for the free food. That's pretty funny. And then, then they actually find uh, Mogar's like um, like on um, like treehouse there. That was all uh, pretty interesting. And find out that the person he's looking for is his mom or something. And yeah, uh, him obviously. Be so probably from the mental ward or, or whatever. So um, I don't know if like his mom was maybe one of the nurses there and that um, she like took care of him or something like that at the um, mental ward or something like that. I'll probably find out that later. Or if it's actually his mom, mom. That's pretty interesting. So man, of course, with him being w getting weaker and weaker without her, that's uh, pretty interesting. Definitely gives some a really nice uh, characterization to Mogar. I really like that. And um. And then, unfortunately, like, with Ash showing up, actually, it caused some fire to the house to burn it down. And then, uh, obviously, we got to see, um, I don't know, like, what the bird's, like, uh, like name here is, but, like, uh, I, like I said before, like, uh, Michael's, um, my kind of character is, like, uh, Banjo-Kazooie, where, yeah, uh, obviously, Morgar being based on uh, Banjo, and then, uh, that bird there, more, like, based on Kazooie, that was pretty funny. And, of course, to see the bird, like, carry up, um, Morgar way, that's definitely how they were to, um, give, like, like, you know, like, if there's, like, a, um, like a, a cliff or a canyon uh, below them, that be, that'd be uh, Kazooie like be able to carry um, Banjo to the other side. So I never liked how they were able to show that here. That was pretty funny. And um, I'll see the. Oh, see, they're probably gonna go to Mentor Warren and see the Mad King. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna love that cuz I absolutely loved uh, the Mad King in the series, and yeah, it's really like really really like Ryan. So I'll definitely uh, be excited to see him and well, whatever else uh, happens uh, in the next episode uh, next week. So stay tuned of uh, next Monday for my reaction to that episode. So yeah, stay tuned for that. So overall, is in this reaction feel. Make sure you like this video. Subscribe to more videos and leave a comment down below. Such a video I strike to next. And yeah, and yeah, of course, usually on Mondays too, I like to re react to uh, Red First Blue uh, Season 12 episodes, but I'll actually be reacting to some more episodes so uh, today. So yeah, stay tuned for that. So, overall, I was in this video. Hope to see you guys very soon. Bye.